I did a lot of fighting in the streets, which I didn't like to do. But me being a dancer, a lot of people tested me because me being a dancer, they thought I was friendly. They thought I was weak, but they didn't know that I had uh, fast feet and I got fast hands. So my ex-girlfriend told me to join a boxing gym and I was trying to find one. And I ended up meeting a boy that was going to college with me. He ended up telling me that he was going out to a boxing gym and I asked him, could I go? And when I went, uh, I fell in love like uh, the first hour. And then like an hour after that, I told Coach Sean, I was like, man, I'm gonna be the champ. I said, we're gonna make the money off of me. I competed in Golden Gloves three times. Also won it three times. <laughs> uh, State Golden Gloves twice. Won, made it to finals, and then nationals. I used to get like real nervous, but then again, I found my swag, I found myself. And so now I be calm in the ring and I be legit, you know. I, I fight my fight. Knowing that you can, you can control somebody's mind and they don't even know it. That's the best part, setting somebody up to get hit when they don't even know it. Making somebody chunk some when they don't really want to chunk it, but you make them chunk it anyway and you're able to connect with it. So it's like, it, it, it's a mind thing when you're in the boxing ring when you're trying to be the best anyway. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, go, I'm trying to go, go past every level that you can go to in boxing. I'm going to win. I can't lose. I don't see me losing. I, ain't, I didn't dream about me losing. Most likely I'm going to win. And there's going to be a, another way on the way to state golden club and nationals. Because I'm not losing. I'm too fast. I'm too pretty. And anybody get in the ring with me, mine.